What's good, y'all? Shout out to the notification gang for hitting the like button. And the video didn't start yet. Y'all are the ones in it. I appreciate you anyway. Shout out Kendra G, man. Still out here killing it. Still, still, still out here killing it, man. Um, listen. I um uh, I haven't seen this video yet. I've heard crazy things about it. I'm not about to play this whole thing. I think this whole thing is about 15 minutes. So what I'll do is I'll put the link in the description. If I forget, please remind me in the comments. But I'll put the link to the full video in the description. I'll probably react to maybe three to five minutes of it. But from what I was gathering in the comment section was uh, she was married, obviously, right? Not obviously, but <laughs> she's married. I'm assuming she has kids. And she got she found her husband sleeping with another woman. She literally walked in on him, apparently, from what they were saying in the comment section. But the main reason why I want to do this video because um the swirlers community is 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 absent. The Cynthia G fans, they're gone. They're absent. What's going on, y'all? Where, where y'all at? I'm gonna make sure to tag y'all channel too. Y'all know how I do. Why y'all not saying nothing about it? I thought I thought I thought the quote unquote white zaddies don't cheat on um, black women, let alone on um, women, period. What happened? So let, let, let's let's hear this, man, because I, I, I gotta I gotta hear, I gotta see what's going on. Hello? Hey. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Kendra. Hi, sweetheart. What's your name, honey? My name's Neslin. Neslin, where are you calling mm -hmm. us from? I'm in Texas. Texas, Neslin. Yeah. Texas. What part real. of Texas? Um, I'm in the Woodlands area. Woodlands, okay. Do you have any kids? I have a daughter, yes. Oh, How's your daughter? How old is your daughter? Huh? She's five years old. Five years old. Have you ever been married? I have, yeah. I was married for seven years. Oh, why did you get divorced? Because men cheat. <laughs> no, I, well, I, okay. Um, the question first was when, and then I guess you could tell me why. But when well, that was why. Before? When was three, three and a half years ago. How'd you find out he cheated on you? Kind of, I kind of walked in on it. No, see, that's why I'm good now. <laughs> Damn it. It's yeah. one thing to cheat. How did you walk in on it? Was it in your home? It was in our, in our bed. <laughs> yeah. I, I, like have, I came home, I came home early from work and. Jesus got to be all in my body in those moments. Cause I Ooh. would snap. Cause I just feel like cheating is cheating. Right. But yeah. how can you be so disrespectful to cheat in our home, in our bed? Did he ever explain that part of the disrespect, but outside of the cheating part? <laughs> Well, he explained that he was lonely for the two hours that I was away. Yeah. And it made sense to him to have a woman in your bed? It doesn't make sense to anyone but him. So. Let me say this. Um, gorgeous black woman, right? Kendra, too. Kendra, I, always thought, I always thought Kendra was fine. Uh, gorgeous black woman. Love her if, if her dreads are real. Love her dreads, right? Gorgeous damn woman. Looks good. Looks, I, I can see her collarbone, so she looks to be in shape. Uh, you know, de decent amount of shape, right? Um, let me say this, <clears throat> and I have zero tolerance for cheating. Zero tolerance for cheating. If you're going to cheat, let me say this, right? Just hear me out. If you are going to cheat, fella, lady super fellas, why bring her to your house? I get it. Hotel is expensive. I ain't gonna cap with y'all. Rent is high, mortgage high, property tax, everything, gas is damn high. So, all right, cool. Pull up to the house. But I have so many questions. If she was at work, why wasn't he at work? Because she, you know, and maybe she covers this. I have no idea. Like I said, I haven't even seen this video yet. I just, I saw, um, what's, what's the name? I saw the tag, obviously, because somebody tagged me in it. Uh, but I saw the comment section, and I was reading through the comments while waiting for the, you know, video to download because it's like 15 minutes long. And so I was waiting, and maybe it took maybe three or four minutes for it to fully to finish downloaded. And by the time I downloaded, I had to, I had to run back to work, so I couldn't even damn watch it. You know, so it, it is what it is, but um, why wasn't he at work? F -f Sir, why did you bring a chick to your house to sleep within in the bed? That's the ultimate form of disrespect. And again, I have a zero tolerance for cheating, but I would more than likely forgive my girl for cheating if she slept with another guy outside the house compared to inside the house. Regardless, I'm leaving anyway, but I'm just saying <laughs> I have a better chance. You have she will have a better chance of me forgiving her because. I pay the bills here. I do this. I do that. Bed is what we're supposed to be laying down, get intimate together, or whatever the case may be. All that. 
and you thought it was okay to bring a whole nother woman or man up in the bed that both y'all supposed to have this this damn union under under the roof that y'all have this damn union under on top of a damn mattress and bed that y'all been sleeping together with. That's just crazy to me. I ain't gonna cap with y'all. Zero, zero. Again, y'all, zero. I don't have no type of tolerance for cheating. Um, I guess that's what matters to him. <laughs> um, someone sure. said that Kendra say snap or stab. Both. <laughs> Whatever word you want. That's why Jesus loves me. God knows me well. And he, he knows my temper because he created me. So he shields me from those type of things. Because I would be the girl. I would be the girl on snap. Y'all be interviewing me from jail. It'll be the jail single show, child. I'll yeah. be somebody's girlfriend. <laughs> I'll be your brother's bitch because I will be in jail after that. Like, I'm, yeah, I'm getting a brother now because I had to kill my husband because this trifling man has someone in our bed. So now I'm dating Roberta, child, for the rest of my life. <laughs> but God has protected me from that. So I'm, I'm sorry you had to go through that. It's all good at this point. All right. <laughs> all right Nestle in Texas, Willem, what do you do for a living? I'm in sales, life insurance and health insurance. Life insurance. Um, what's your zodiac sign? Gemini. Gemini. May 22nd. May, May baby. Um Can't stand Gemini's. <laughs> Can't stand them. Cannot stand, stand the ass, man. Cheaters. Um, <laughs> just be honest. Just be honest. Uh, honesty goes a very long way. Anybody out here judging you, just be yourself and, you know, um, we'll take it from there. Deal breaker. Oh, well, breaker. Um, lethargic, just like stagnant mentally and physically, just staying in one place, not really trying to move forward in life and blaming the world for your disadvantages, you know, um, someone who can own his own, be responsible. And I guess that's, <laughs> I think that's it for now. Okay. Do you, um, do you want to get married again? I do. Yeah. Okay. Um, they, I'm sorry to go back to that terrible moment, child, but, um, do you, um, they want to know what did you do when you walked in on your husband and the other woman? <laughs> I, I honestly, I was paralyzed because I never thought that would ever happen. Yeah, I was, you know, shocked because I had him on a pedestal. My own, my entire family um, knows this. I uh, I spoke so highly of him. It just shocked me. She put him on a pedestal because he was Caucasian. Everybody looked at him so highly in her fa in her family because he was Caucasian. Oh, I, I I was shocked because I never thought he would do it because he's Caucasian. This is the type of stupid ass stuff, right? And I'm gonna just throw black people under it. This is the type of stupid ass stuff that black people say, and it really gets under my skin. Black men do this too. So black men, y'all not safe. Black men and black women say the stupidest thing about each other when they start dating interracially. And I'm not saying she said it, so that's all that's I'm saying. But in the comment section, like I said, the swirlers community, if y'all know what the swirlers is, y'all can do your research on, on the swirlers community. It's a swirlers community, it's obvious. I mean, you know, what, what it sound like is black women dating white or Hispanic or whatever uh, other man that's not black. And they get together, they form this group together where they talk down on black men and they talk highly of how happy they are in, the, in their relationships. One thing they almost never mention in the special in the sport community and Cynthia G, uh, one thing that them two, uh, you know, uh, channels, I guess you can say, uh, never mention is that infidelity happens in their relationships too. Abuse happens in their relationships too. Murders happen in their relationships too. They will almost always try to deflect or try not to even speak on it. And, and this video has been pretty popular. I think I got it on Facebook. It was at, um, I think it was at like 800,000 views or something like that. That's pretty, that's damn near viral nowadays. But they haven't said anything. And this isn't the first time that something like this has been publicly, uh, you know, talked about. But they will almost always ignore it. Again, fellas, I need y'all to listen. Oh, well, I was just shocked. I was, I, I, I was, I was, I couldn't move. I just never thought that he would do it. Why? Because he's Caucasian? Oh, well, I spoke highly. My family knows I spoke highly of him. And my family looked at him different and, 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 and treated him to a higher standard. Why? Because he's Caucasian? 
just crazy. And then I, I took his phone and <laughs> basically locked myself in a car. Um, you know, so like, you took his phone during it and you locked yourself in the car? Yeah, because I wanted to see what was going on in there, like what else was being hidden. Um, I, I didn't know. I honestly, my mind was just so flustered and so, such in shock that I, I didn't react the way any of you guys thought or think I should have. <laughs> did they, I'm assuming they stopped. Did he try to run after you and apologize? He did, um, and he he was. I, I think he was more fearful of what, what what I would find in his phone. To be honest. <laughs> Shame. Okay, so that's what happened. All right, enough of him. The new guy, does he have to look a certain way? Athletic I don't know. is my preference. Um, but I I will not, you know, judge someone who just cannot get there. When I say cannot, meaning just like not just not mentally, but, you know, medically cannot get there. Um, but athletic, because I'm an athletic. What do you mean medically cannot get there? Because, you know, there are some people who are, like, you know, thyroid problems and things like that. Just, like, it's just an imbalance when it comes to, like, weight loss and things. There's There are different reasons as to why people, you know, have a little bit of weight on their body, you know? So I don't want to... You know, I, I was recently talking to my doctor yesterday, actually. And he said that um, obesity is now a disease. And I said, well, how does it make it a disease? And he said, because there's some people who literally cannot lose weight and it's not because... They're not working out, not because they're not eating right. It's, it can be due to different imbalances in their body. And now that that. So listen, all right, I'm, I'm done. I, 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 would, I didn't even think I was going to make it to six minutes. My bad. Um, anyway, y'all, again, like I said, I will put the full link, um, the video link in the description if y'all want to watch the whole thing. Um, you, know, you know what I'm saying? Again, I, <clears throat> if I forget, then let me know in the comment section. Sometimes, bro, I, I upload anywhere from 10 to 20, sometimes even 25 videos in one sitting. And I'm going through it one by one, editing, creating the thumbnails, doing this, creating the hashtag, doing blah, 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 blah. And sometimes I miss a few. So if I do miss it, then just let me know in the comment section. It's not that serious. You know, you know, y'all know I got y'all. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I want y'all to comment down below and let me know what y'all thought about this video, man. Um, the moral of the story is, ladies, black women, everybody damn cheats. Please stop going and fellas, everybody, black men too. Everybody got damn cheese. Every damn woman of every damn race cheese. I've met Caucasian women that cheated. I made Asian girls that cheated. I made Hispanic women that cheated and vice versa. I've met Caucasian guys that cheated. I got a Caucasian coworker who's cheat on his wife often with the women that we work with. But you know, that's that I don't even I just I, I'm I'm on my laptop doing what I gotta damn do. Cause it ain't none of my business. <laughs> but I've seen Caucasian men cheat, I've seen Hispanic men cheat, I've seen Asian men damn cheat. I don't understand what this stupid ass damn thing is between the black women versus the black men and vice versa that you have to not only date outside of the race. And if you date outside the race, that's cool. H have fun. I wish you the best. But like I always said, my problem is when in situations like that is that when you, a black man or a black woman, date outside your race and you start talking down on 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 that on that um on on on, on that race, on that male or that female, whatever it is that you're, that, that you're dating, that's the thing I don't like. You know what I'm saying? So anytime I see something like that, I'm gonna always speak up about it and 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 damn um, and call it how I see it. <laughs> yeah, let me say it like that, man. But um, but yeah, beautiful woman nestling, beautiful name too. You know what I'm saying? But I want y'all to comment down below. Let me know what you thought about this video, man. Thanks for watching. And until next time, please, man, y'all be safe, Erica.